The classic steak tartare. I've done this many ways, but this is the way I learned it when I was at Rockpool, and I absolutely love it. Brunoise shallot, chopped capers, chopped gherkin, chopped anchovy, shredded parsley. And obviously, you're going to need some raw beef. So people say rump works really good, but I actually prefer fillet. Some people mint it. I actually like to dice it with a knife. So this is everything you're going to need. And now we're going to make the sauce. So I do 10 splashes of Tabasco, 5 splashes of Lee and Perrins, a tablespoon of Dijon mustard, a good pinch of salt, a few grinds of black pepper, one egg yolk, 50% olive oil and 50% vegetable oil to turn it into a mayonnaise. Finish off with a good squeeze of lemon. And that's your sauce done. You're going to mix this together. You want to work it quite vigorously to get it all mixed together nicely. It goes like a, I don't know, I don't want to say a paste because that's a bit off-putting, but it goes really beautiful like that. Like I said, this isn't a traditional style of steak tartare. This is where I learned off Neil Perry at Rockpool, but it's absolutely fantastic. 